Okay, I am today playing uh, Badland Bandits, which is an early access game. It's free to play. Uh, I think it's uh, developed in Russia, or at least Eastern Europe, because uh, one of the complaints on the uh, community is that there are no uh, American, North American servers, or <coughs> the ping to them is so bad, since all the servers are in Europe, makes them playable. Um, certainly, there are some language and spelling issues that that's, uh, point to it not being the developer's native language. Um, but I was playing it earlier. It seems to work pretty well. Uh, I'll just turn the volume of the sound down a bit. There we go, there we go. So, it's basically uh, an arena combat game, multiplayer online, with cars. So I was playing a bit earlier. I think I'm just about to level this car up. I have, you know, the basic car with some crappy guns. Uh, you can't, well, opinions vary on whether you can actually pay to win. The developers are very sensitive about it, certainly not being paid to win. Uh, people on the community site are claiming it is, because you can buy the best vehicle. But the developers are saying that the vehicles, they're not... You know, there are no Uber vehicles. You have to just shoot better, sort of thing. We'll see how it goes. Obviously, I'm not really good at shooting straight. I played earlier for well, well 20 minutes, two two games online, and uh, I think I killed one other player in that time. So it'll be interesting to see if I uh, if I can level up my vehicle, whether that makes a big difference. Alright, so... There you go, I'll kill straight away. So there. Battle. So there's a capture the flag. The capture the flag set up, and oh, I've died again. That's true, I probably wasn't hitting very much. But there we go. So there's a flag up there, someone's obviously captured it. Oh, drive straight. He's just ignoring me, as he should. dead again. So you can see I'm not doing much damage to the opponents. They're doing quite a lot of damage to me. There isn't anyone flying around on this map yet, which was a... Uh, I did find that, that the people flying had a severe advantage uh, when I was playing earlier. Teleporter thing. We go through the teleporters. I'm not sure if if they have a specific location. Oh. There we go. I've gone through the teleporter. I don't know what it did to me. I also get the impression this game will be easier with a controller because steering with a keyboard and then shooting at things is awkward. You got a full range of motion with the uh, Ah, I nearly got him. I nearly got him.
There we go. I've killed someone. Let's go and capture something then. So the score at the top, I think, tickets, that's the number of respawns you get. So the game ends when one of the team runs out of respawns. That's how I understand it. And various different things. Ooh, I've leveled up there, you see? Various things impact the respawns. Like capturing, but also obviously people people dying. Totally wiped me out, didn't he? So, we're fairly close to this game being over, I think. Now, I do like the, um, the graphical style, it's quite nice, it's sort of steampunky. Steampunky, uh, Hey, I killed another enemy. That's one coming. There are some glitches, but then it's an early access. What do you expect? We've captured all of them. He's just blown up, which would indicate someone's shooting at him. Is that right? No, that bloke's shooting at him. So I think there's only four of us playing. So. Again, he blew me up. Where's my teammate? He got distracted, obviously. So, you've got to give him props for doing a Linus version of the game straight off the bat. The game does seem to be, you know, it's for early access. Get some. You do get some issues with uh, games that just don't work. This game seems to be, ooh, basically functional. Basically functional in all respects. There we go. Got him. Doesn't have a lot of players. Oh. Doesn't have a lot of players. Oh, I fell off that time. Crashed. Crashed. So when I played earlier, I think there was eight people. looks to me like <laughs> looks to me like there are four people on this server at the minute or possibly three yeah four people which isn't given this is Saturday night Adam. Given it's Saturday night, which ought to be peak time sort of thing, that's got to be a bit disappointing. And you've got to wonder if free to play is. Free to play is really. It's probably going to work when you've got millions of players. Uh, Ganging up on us now. Look. It's going to work when you've got millions of players. Defeat. Ooh. We're getting some achievement progress. I don't know if free to play is going to be 
enough to support this game going forward. But still, for what it is, it's quite fun. Certainly when there's no people flying around killing everybody. Yeah, I've got four kills. Totally rocking. Personal result. The flying things seem to be yeah, about half the damage taken as dealt. It seems to be quite difficult to uh, defeat the flying devices. I don't know why they're they are. Flying devices down the bottom here. Every helicopter, if you're in a vehicle. <coughs> so it's, it looks like you really have to play for a long time to get to the uh, get to the good vehicles. <coughs> Excuse me. And the problem with a small with a small player base is that. You're therefore not, you know, you're quite often not going to get balanced servers because you need you need a large player base to have noob servers because you need to have enough noobs to populate a server. So clearly, this is a game not without issues uh, going forward, but I quite like it as, as it stands. Uh, it's it's reasonable fun driving around shooting the people in your car. It might be somewhat tedious leveling up to the point where you are actually going to be useful in a in a higher level higher level battle. Oh, I can choose a different car. I can have that. Can I have that? Let's try. Ah, excellent against aircrafts. So again, I'm not entirely sure whether my inability to kill things is my usual lack of skill or it's down to me just not being a high enough level. Um, so clearly bear that in mind as you uh, consider consider a purchase. But if you're concerned that it's you know, non-functional early access trash, it isn't and it's free to play so Download it on your Linux box and give it a go. And we'll just uh, get in here into a different map. We'll let you see that. I can drive around for a bit and uh, and wrap up the video. Waiting players. Let's see. Four seconds. Five capture points. All right, so this is a slow moving vehicle. capture point. One problem I did have when I first played the game was working out whether it was red or green. I'm not sure what the indicator is supposed to be. Uh, and I only was able to work out when someone else killed me. Flag. That's low speed. And capture it. And our team. Oh, that BBBM bike's on my team now. Let's head on out. Someone's got a helicopter on the side of it. Seen any enemies so far? At least now you've seen uh, seen some variety in the uh, in the map design. I 
an enemy. Let's go over and shoot at him. Ow. been killed once again. I think he was flying. So, I'm going to leave the video there. I'm uh, obviously pretty bad at it all round. We're going to get beat again. I've not been on the winning team yet, to be fair. But yeah, check it out. Badland Bandits, uh, free to play, native, native Lance version available. Go for it.